And it's Bonnie. Happy Saturday. Check it out. I've been stacking candles. Who else gets immense joy from stacking their candles? <laughs> These are mostly like the candle day selections after candle day. But um, I decided I would kind of rearrange a little bit, kind of move it away from Christmas. Unfortunately, Christmas is in what, six days? Oh my gosh, you guys. So I did get to Bath and Body Works this morning. Yay, there weren't a lot of people there, but there was an entire huge stack of the cookies and cream milkshake. It's funny because I was not expecting to find this one. I figured it was a candle day exclusive. Once it was gone, it was gone. But I'm hearing from a lot of people on Instagram that their stores are getting these in for semi-annual sales. So watch out for this collection. And it looks like this. It's got the pink apple punch, uh, watermelon lemonade, which was online, um, the peach bellini, island margarita, clementine Ooh. sherbet that everyone wants. So it's kind of exciting that these candles are now showing up um, heading into semi-annual sales. So that's awesome. So if I um, can get another one of these on sale next week, I think I'm going to pick up a second cookies and cream milkshake. Oh my gosh, you guys, I was not expecting to love this one so much. So I didn't know what to expect. A lot of people said it's not like Oreo, even though there's like a little Oreo cookie on it. Um, a few people have said it was similar to hot cocoa and cream with a little bit more vanilla. I think that's probably the most accurate representation, but it is good. Oh my gosh. So the scent notes are chocolate cookie crumbles, vanilla bean ice cream, and chocolate drizzle. <laughs> it's funny. This looks more dangerous than it is. I swear. Like, I'm nowhere near the wax falling on me. <laughs> um, but it's not online. I forgot to write the scent notes down. But this one is absolutely delightful, and it's funny because I, I pulled my hot fudge sundae just for a minute because I just was kind of curious to see if it had any relation to hot fudge sundae, which is the um, gooey fudge vanilla bean ice cream and whipped cream. Not even close. I didn't even burn this one, by the way, you guys. This is this is one of my collectibles. Um, this one smells so good. This one is way more fudgy. I mean, this one is like pure fudge little bit of ice cream. Look how pretty that is, though. Um, hot cocoa and cream smells more like chocolate. This one smells more like vanilla bean with a little bit of chocolate in it. Oh my gosh, you guys. I am a huge fan of vanilla. I was a little disappointed this year that Vanilla Bean Noel wasn't quite as um, strong because I just, I love any vanilla scents. I love it when you put a scent with vanilla. Um, it's just, I would say it's in my top three of all time favorite scents on the planet is just pure vanilla extract. I absolutely love it. So for me, this candle being heavy on the vanilla bean was just like, whoa, this was amazing. So I lit this one up probably about two or three hours ago, and it's been burning in here. Um, I've been kind of cleaning, so I left the room a couple times, came back in. Um, the set is definitely moving from this room into the dining room and the living room, which is nice. It's not strong, but it's not like weak either. It's just a gentle scent. It's not an overpowering scent. Anything with vanilla usually isn't. Um, but this one, I would say the throw is a solid medium. I mean, this one does have throw. It's just that it's not like a heavy scent. But oh my goodness. I mean, this one, I would say, I'm going to say it. Aside from, of course, my favorite strawberry pound cake over here. I started to put up my strawberry pound cake collection. I think this is one of my favorites from Candle Day um, that I picked up, um, including the um, the Clementine Sherbert. I am so impressed with this entire pop culture collection. Um, if you haven't picked up the Clementine Sherbert yet, I would highly recommend this one. I just got the Island Margarita and the Peach Bellini this morning. Can't wait to review those for you guys. I don't know. I think the design and the scents in this collection were the clear winners for Candle Day. Because this one is just, I would say this is probably my number one favorite Candle Day candle. Like I said, obviously Strawberry Pound Cake coming back was 
a pretty a pretty big joy. <laughs> but as far as like a new scent, I'm like this cookies and uh, cream milkshake is like the number one winner. Hope is going into semi annual sale that they put this entire collection online for people who can't get in the store. I am also hoping that if you didn't have this in your store for Candlelight, because we didn't, and we're a fairly big store, I think they had like maybe like 10 of them, um, that your store now has these. We had probably about 50 of them in the store, which was a lot. And um, who knows, they could be getting more in. So even at $15.95, if you really want this candle, I suggest going into um, a store like early next week before the summer annual sale crowd shows up and picking this one up because it is it is worth it oh my gosh that vanilla bean scent in this one is so nice it doesn't have any funky like musky smell it doesn't have a floral this one is a straight on vanilla foodie with like a hint of chocolate it's amazing i i am i am sold on this candle and like i said you know me i usually don't buy too many dupes because I'm a reviewer. I, I'm going through candles constantly and there's always new ones coming out for the season. But like the butter rum eggnog, you guys, I don't know. This one, this one is really high on my list. I will be doing my top, probably do my top 30 candles of all of 2020 pretty soon. Um, it's hard. I, this, is, this is definitely a difficult task to pick my top 30 of 2020 because there's a lot of good ones this year um, that have surfaced. So I don't know. Let's hope for some annual sale. These go on sale. That would be amazing. I'd be snapping those up in a second. <laughs> so anyway, thank you so much for watching. I might do another candle review later tonight. I have so much, so many candles to review. I will see you guys later. Bye-bye.